MTD CNC, bringing you the latest engineering news, reviews, events, and special offers via video media. We've arrived at uh, FT Gearing Systems in order shot. Um, we're on, here on behalf of Mitutoyo UK to have a look at uh, a lot of investment from FT Gearing. Trevor, uh, we're here at FT Gearing Systems. Uh, could you tell me a little bit about what you do here? Well, we're a, um, an engineering company making parts for the aerospace industry, mainly uh, gears, gears for uh, the airline industry and military gears. So the investment that you've got here is obviously machine tools, obviously cutting materials. What else do you have? Well, we've heavily invested in Mitsutoyo uh, measuring machines, such as the Strata that's in the background at the moment. Um, without, without these pieces of equipment, we could not manufacture our parts. Um, we're dealing with 3 micron cylinders, the flatness of um, 1.3 microns, and you just couldn't measure without having quality pieces of equipment. So, any particular reason why uh, Mitsutoyo has been the preferred supplier? Well, um, we've built up a big uh, relationship with them over the years um, and there are some great other suppliers out there, great equipment, but the whole package that they give us, if we have a, a measuring problem, uh, say on one of our machines that we cannot do because we haven't got the technical ability, they have experts on hand, you, they can either talk you through it over the phone or they'll be down within a day and they help us program, show us how to do things. If we have a breakdown um, of any of our equipment, it's usually within a day they're with us. And um, we have service contracts on, on all of our machines, so they do the calibration and service, which is a yearly thing. So the service is, is fantastic, to be honest. Could you tell me what you're doing with this component? Well, this is a new development worm shaft that we're doing, an 11 start that no one else has been able to manufacture uh, before. We've got a cam on the top. Um, we didn't know how to measure it, so with this new Strato Mitsutoyo, it's got a scanning head on it, and with the CAD CAM on the you know, computer, we can compare the CAD CAM model to our measurements. Um, Mitsutoyo came in, fitted the software, showed us how to program it, and now we're getting perfect um, measurements from this machine. Everything passes gauge R&R, &R and um, price and accuracy really does it for us. How long have you been working with Mitsutoyo? Oh, um, 30 years maybe, maybe even longer. Um, Trevor Stubbs, who's the main sales rep, I suppose I've known him personally about 15 years, something like that. And the, and the type of investment that you've actually made with Mitsutoyo with the machines here? I couldn't put a real price on it, but it's running into the millions, so that's pretty big. Uh, you've got a round test uh, product from Mitsutoyo, could you tell me how you use this? Yes, uh, we do all of these uh, match gears for Rolls-Royce. Um, we need to measure cylindricity, and without a round test machine, you cannot measure cylindricity. You can measure the elements, right. but you couldn't prove that it was less than three micron cylindricity, and that's what we need to do. This machine will also do total runout, flatness, parallelism, um, all of which we need to record um, and store for each gear that we manufacture for Rolls-Royce. So obviously that gives them the opportunity of actually proving what they've asked you to do, you've done it? Exactly, if they have a problem within their gearbox, uh, they'll phone me up and ask for a serial number and the results, and I can just email them the results. Does, it, does this actually save you time, obviously resulting in cost as well with this product? Yes, definitely. Um, if we were going to do this manually, it's a lot of hard work and then getting the cylindricity figure would be the problem. And then how do you store those results? Here on this machine we get uh, graphic results as well as the um, data, all of the numbers which stack up. So it just proves the work perfectly.
Nigel, tell me a little bit more about FT Gearing. Well, FT Gearing has been going since 1978. My father started the business uh, to get into the uh, world of transmissions, saw a, a marketplace for transmission that hadn't been filled. Um, my brother joined the company first, then I came second. Um, we both went through the shop floor, learning all aspects of machining, uh, but we, we specialise in gears and that's where our recent investment is and that's pretty much got us to where we are in the aerospace industry is our knowledge of, gear, of, of gearboxes and, and transmissions. So with regards to the actual uh, facility you've got here, this is obviously inspection and measurement, obviously where you're cutting gears, but you've got two other sites here as well. Yeah, we have approximately 10,000 square foot, uh, which is 250 yards away. We have four more units where we specialise in the Citizen CNC sliding head uh, turning, we, um, Mazak uh, Integrex milling and turning, and uh, uh, normal CNC turning as well. So they're more of our manufacturing and turning the blanks parts before they come to here for gear cutting and gear grinding processes. So your uh, investment in the company over the years, would you like to put a figure on it? Uh, the investment in machine tools alone in the last five years has probably been about six or seven million. With uh, premises also, that's probably, uh, you know, you put at least another third on that. Um, gear machines in this unit alone has been three million in the last two years with new technology and CBN grinding and dressable CBN grinding as well, which is something we've got into uh, in a big way with, uh, with our, uh, our machine tool supplier in Switzerland. We've helped develop our machines with them. So growth, what are you looking to achieve over the next few years? Well, that does depend on our customers and where they're going, obviously, but uh, obviously we try and grow every year. We're turning over a uh, plus of six million a year at the moment. Obviously growth would be, we'd like to put another 10% off that if, if possible. But again, it depends how the market is. Predominantly, I know your business is in the aerospace sector, but is there other sectors you'd like to pitch for? Uh, yeah, we've been involved with motorsport in the past uh, as, as a contractor to, for making um, gears for uh, rally cars and, and a little bit of Formula One work as well. Uh, yeah, we're open to all the other types of markets that require gears or splines. Well, I must say, fantastic facility, fantastic people. Thanks very much for your hospitality and lovely to see you UK manufacturing grow. Thank you very much. It's our pleasure. For more videos, products and news, go to mtdcnc.com or follow MTD Online on Twitter.